Hello everyone, my name is Ning Cam and this is the second in a series of short tutorials on violin playing in general. Today we're going to continue talking about tone production. Now, as I was mentioning in the first tutorial, when the hair of the bow catches the string, it sends vibrations into the atmosphere. And what that does is that it actually rearranges the molecules in the air. So you're sending the molecules vibrating to the end of the room that you're in. Now, when you're playing in a small room, obviously you can really feel the molecules being sent at the end of your small room. But when you're in a massive hall, that's a different story altogether. You're going to have to adjust the resistance of the bow hair on the string accordingly so that you send as many molecules moving around in the room as possible. Now one exercise that you could do to really feel the resistance of the hair on the string moving the molecules in the air is this. Do it with an elbow. Now you'll notice that the thicker the string, the slower you're going to have to move your bow, and the thinner, the faster. It's all felt in your fingertips as they contact the bow stick, and you can feel the vibrations and the resistance of the string. It's an incredible art, playing the violin, and I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. Happy practicing, and see you at the next one.